Hey everyone, welcome to Data Million News. I'm Atul, and in this video, we are going to talk about SQL alias for a table. So let's move ahead and talk about why do we need this SQL alias. So SQL alias are used to give a table or a column in a table a temporary name, and these are often used to make table name more readable and it will only exist for the duration of your query so let's go and write a simple query to show how we can use sql aliases to create a temporary name for our table so we have our table which is subscriber base in our email data right so what we can do is that we can write select star from email data dot subscriber base right and now if i run this query it will give us the entire result suppose for an instance this subscriber base seems to be very big name what you can do is that you can simply after the table name you can put a temporary name just like this by putting this keyword as and you will put the subscriber base short form which is sb now even if you run this query now you will find out that query is running fine and you are getting your result set now if you are using multiple tables with join then you will have to use this aliases so that you can get selected columns from multiple tables and to get that data what you need to do is that you need to use a, this alias and alias of this table and then you need to put the column name so for example i am putting sb dot first underscore name so now sql knows that sb is alias for subscriber base and it will only fetch subscriber base dot first name which is this column and it will show us the first name only in our result set so this is how basically we use aliases for tables in SQL. If you want to learn or understand more about SQL, then you can click on the right side of this video. Or if you want to learn about Excel, then you can write on the left side of this video. Happy learning and see you in the next video.